Okay, here we got the funky downspout. If you look, here's another one. It's good. It's the inside wall's intact, and it goes all the way through the, the uh, soffit, right? So this one here, it's rusted, right? And it goes into the attic. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna clean this up real good, and we're gonna use some uh, some of this pipe here, this plastic pipe, and run it through there. Uh, it's got a little bit smaller diameter than the stock uh, downspout, and uh, but anyway, we're gonna clean this up and run it through there. The problem is, is that with this thing open like this, rats can crawl in there and go right up in the attic, and then they'll go through the walls and, and you know raise havoc, right? Uh, so uh, anyway, that's what we're going to do. I just have to widen this edge here a little bit, stick that pipe down there, and then put some roofing cement over the top. Make sure it runs out the bottom real good, and uh, go from there. Okay, so this is the cut down spout, and I'm going to have to connect something up here later. But uh, at least we have the, the soffit plugged up so the rodents can't crawl in. What I'm going to do is I have this stick up just a little bit, and so it'll stick up just a little bit above the, uh, the roof. And so that... You know, I can glue it in real good uh, with the roof cement. I use vinegar and the Scotch Brite to clean it up real good. You want it nice and clean so that uh, so that everything sticks to it. And so, uh, yeah, let's put her okay, in. So you want to get your heavy-duty roof patch stuff and uh, make sure that everything's kind of like double gooped in here. Um, and so, uh, also, there's this chance that the little rodents inside, if there's any inside, they'll chew on this. So I'm gonna goop that up real good. Get this edge up real good and uh, put this thing through here. I put a screw here on the side so I can kind of hold it from going all the way in. And ideally, you want to wear gloves, of course. And so, yeah, that's kind of yeah. So I, I, I <laughs> should have worn gloves, but uh, yeah, that's that's what it's looking like right now. Um, Hopefully when this dries, it'll all be kind of like solid and everything. But, uh, and I put that little screen on there so the creepy crawlers won't be creeping in there. The louder the muffler, the lower the IQ. In my world. And I, I don't really, really understand why they have the drag races over here. And, uh, it like shakes the whole damn city, man. Um... And then they've got the, the circle track races. This is whatever this little circle track stock car thing. And it's like, I mean, if they're going to have e-cars, e and that, maybe that's a little different. But, man, these things, like, are a public nuisance as far as I'm concerned. They make a lot of noise, produce a lot of pollution. And um, so, yeah, we got hot rods around here. Um, I think the louder the muffler, the higher the IQ, you know. And it's the, the opposite as far as I'm concerned. And now, so if you cut your pipes just the right size, you can fit it into your uh, original downspout. This one actually has a little bit of soffit damage, you can see. And we're going to uh, patch that up with a little plywood. And uh, should be good to go. Okay, so here's the icing on the cake. If you have some of the spare dirt, you can kind of sprinkle it around. And it adds to the strength of it a little bit. Helps it blend in. And you're good to go. Well, that's a quick roof, roof patch job for today. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you need any help, uh, you can contact me, 707-443-8347. So I do uh, local uh, repair jobs. And just let me know.